So let's now take a look at what the new Media Central is for post-production. So on the left here you can see the ecosystem we're all very familiar with. You have Seats and Media Composer, whether they're editors, assistant editors or loggers or producers, or using a Seed and Media Composer connected to an Avid Nexus for shared storage and shared projects. What editorial management adds is an extra layer across the top of that um, for added functionality of asset management to Media Composer users, as well as adding core functionality um, in your workflow through a web browser. Uh, so let's take a look at what some of those features can be. So Media Central Editorial Management is a very lightweight asset management solution. So you can see that right there on the right hand side, editorial management just appears as a panel now uh, within your Media Composer. So you're not having to bounce between different user interfaces for your asset management system. You can have it right there next to your timeline and drag and drop assets that you've found through various different means, which we'll get onto, into your timeline. Um, so this doesn't impact the day-to-day -day life of the editor. It just makes everything more simple. Um, for the cloud version, and we should stress here that that means a web user interface rather than a seed of media composer. What that looks like is very simple login either on the LAN or if you have a secure VPN set up, you can be outside the LAN environment. Here, producers, assistant editors, and loggers can do some core features which would previously require either a seat media composer or a kludgy workflow where you're rendering files and, and bouncing them around. So through this Cloud UX version, which runs with editorial management, you can do review and approval of a flattened sequence straight through your web user interface. So a producer can just log in, review and approve the sequence, add notes and, and markers, and not have to come down to the edit bay. Second, loggers can now log footage in the web browser. They don't need to be sitting on in an editorial bay to log footage. They can just be on a laptop with the web browser. And thirdly, you can even create rough cut sequences uh, through this Cloud UX version of the user interface, and then obviously open them up in a full seed of media composer. So let's go back and look at some of the other features. Um, you can leverage the usual shared project bins that you normally do in a media composer between Cloud UX and the regular seed of media composer. And all of this just runs on a pretty low cost server that sits on top of your Avid Nexus storage and integrates the browser and search across different projects. So unlike a lot of other asset management systems, this is fully integrated into the Media Composer ecosystem. And it's designed to be more out of the box. It only includes the key functions and features that you need for an, a, a traditional post-production workflow. Now, as well as logging footage and sharing projects and tagging clips the traditional asset management way, um, Media Central can also add in phonetic search, which if you're familiar with Nexidia, um, this is now fully integrated into the Media Central platform. So you can search for spoken words um, just by typing in text uh, through multiple languages. Spelling doesn't have to be accurate because it uses phonetics. And none of this footage has to be transcribed. So as long as the system sees the footage and scans it, you can then search for certain words and phrases. So if you're looking for lines in a script across multiple clips, multiple takes, or you just want to find um, time codes where somebody says certain words and then use that as a marker. So no more transcribing. All in all, a much better and quicker way of finding content through spoken words. There's also now an integrated QA system for closed captioning at the end of your workflow, which can help verify the words that are spoken actually match the captions on the screen, the timing and alignments, and make sure they meet all of the requirements of your delivery.